The Appalachian Advantage plan is the simpler, better way to get the phone you actually want. Instead of paying hundreds of dollars up front, simply pay the taxes up front and a few extra dollars on your monthly bill and get the phone you really want. It's called the Appalachian Advantage and is available at Appalachian Wireless. Governor Andy Beshear's draft state budget is still a work in progress, but it's causing some concerns on several fronts. One is right here in Eastern Kentucky in the form of the US 460 Highway Construction Project in Pike County. Bashir's proposed budget would delay the project, in particular the construction of the Beaver Creek Bridge for upwards of five years. The budget removes the funding for the bridge, which is one of the most important phases of the project. State Representative Chris Harris told me today that he is confident the bridge will be finished in the original time frame next year and that the budget is still in development and is nowhere near final. Well, I think definitely it needs to be a priority. We've got a you know half a billion dollar road that you know that's there that's you know, been constructed over the, a, a number of years that we're missing one key piece to, to finish it. So absolutely, I think it's a priority, and um, and uh, I will, I have already been in contact with the uh, uh, administration, letting them know that uh, you know that we we're not happy or satisfied with uh, what the proposal that's, uh, that was put forth and you know their explanation to me was that you know they've got new people and put together a 24 billion dollar budget in a little over a month you know there's going to be uh, hiccups like this and that uh, they've committed to me to do everything they can to get the, the money put back in uh, to the 2021 uh, time frame. I'm one vote on the uh, uh, House Budget Review Subcommittee but I'm, uh, I'm certainly going to be pushing for that and doing all that I can, as I'm sure that uh, Senator Wheeler will be doing in the in the Senate. Um, you know, this is an important project, not only for the citizens and people that are going to use the brakes and, and access to, to Elkhorn, but also the, uh, the the economic development aspect of it. You know, there's several fields there that uh, they could be opened up for uh, economic development. So we're definitely going to be playing that. Uh, angle uh, as well and working to try to get this Beaver Creek Bridge uh, project put back uh, on the fast track. The new 460 replaces the current two-lane highway between Pikeville and the Elkhorn City area.